Hello there. You're gonna need the Pro TV from Architect Tenon. You're gonna need Video RT and LTCGI. What is recommended also is to download Filamented or other LTCGI ready shaders. First, you wanna take the uh, prefabs for the TV Slim. I'm gonna put it on the side because I've put a collider on the rest so that you can walk. And then you can create a quad that I'm gonna blit. On the VRT prefab, there's a blit shader called Video Blit. Put it in there, add a Video Pro, a uh, Navy Pro video screen, make it shared. Click on 1080p, that's your video player. And that's how you set up uh, this. Then add another quad, that's gonna be your screen. Drag in the screen. Then go to Pi, LTCGI. Grab the controller, and in here, Put the video, um, the video render texture from here. Then place your screen however you want. There you go. Then put the LTCGI screen on here. LTC diffuse texture and uh, red. Once you've done that, back the f in the scene first. The brightness of the screen can simply be controlled by changing the light map intensity here. Make sure that on your screen components, you either have the render distance for the affected renders, or only list the renders that should be affected to improve performance. Make sure that all of your uh, meshes are static. You can also use the default Unity light mapper. Once this is rendered first, you're going to see the world looking like it should be without LTCGI. Then go on your controller and click Bake Shadow Map. You will see that the screen turned red. Once it is rendered, you should see a pop-up saying finishing LTCGI Bake and you will see it should be all red like this and have shadows. Once this is done, render again. Once this is done, make sure that this is on texture. Additionally, you might want to have your video player non-specialized. For this, go to Pro TV, 1080p, speakers, disable one of the two speakers, and then make this a stereo, this to zero, 2D, and then disable the specialization here. Simply upload. Simply make sure that you import all prefabs before importing my example scene. Once uploaded, you should see that the screen emits light in the scene. 